Hello everyone. So I'm going to make another little tutorial of how to change your envelopes and I hope you enjoy this little one that I'm doing. So it's basically a fold up, cut across, and you can glue this down. So let's just show you how to do it. It doesn't matter if it has stuff on it. It doesn't matter if this part is a window because in all reality you're not going to be using it. So we do that. Then we take the time to cut off our ends. Don't really want it that deep, so we're just going to do it this one. And so it lines up perfectly. I recommend using a template for your corners. Then you know your lines are going to be good. Come this. So now I'm going to start decorating. Actually, I think I'm going to start decorating after I get these two done. Just because, why not? And you can make them any size you want. Okay. So this one, I'm going to make a deeper cut this time so And again, you can make it as big or small as you want it. You don't have to do any particular size. Again, the only reason why I'm using the template is to make sure when I go to fold it down, it isn't going to be all awkward or weird. I'm going to use this longer one, actually, this for this one, too. But, again, it, it just makes it more dimensionally pleasing and easier to fold. Now, you could also cut this part and do the same to this bottom part, but for this tutorial, we're not doing that. Not this time. Maybe the next time we'll do that. Now let's get to decorating. Why not have some fun with this? I'm just cutting bits off so I can use this piece and it will be easier to use. We'll see. I'm hoping that's what the case will be anyways. And yeah, I'm just using my art glitter glue. I don't mind using it. I have quite a bit of it, actually. So, 
using it up is one of my goals if that makes sense instead of letting it sit Now this one, I was thinking, what if I take this and just glue it? I know it seems strange. Why am I gluing it sort of in the inside but not? Because I want it to stay when I stick this piece in. My five-year-old's obviously just trying to piss off my <laughs> older kid <laughs> at the moment which happens it's their age group I got that totally crooked, so I'm trying to fix it. There we go. Now I'm going to glue this piece down. So it stays down. And then I'm going to grab my distress ink here and distress around as much as I can. Mommy, gotta go away. I know because you were purposely annoying her, which means you're going to go on timeout after I'm done with my video. Mommy. Yeah, mm. that's what you do with, get when you're purposely trying to instigate people. Bella or it's Rosie not. you were instigating her don't even start that was, my youngest likes to create fights with her sister all the time and she thinks it is perfectly okay now again we could have easily made this into a double pocket I just or another pocket I just chose not to with this round yeah, because that was the sample I have at this point. So, there we go. We got our first one done. Undecorated, but decorated at the same time. All right, let's grab another one and start working with another digital 
again, I'm just grabbing digitals out, seeing what I have, try to create something with nothing, basically. This one with a bunch of random pieces. I think we can come up with something with these pieces. I'm hoping anyways. Really? Why? Why we was in the bathroom? Cool. In house. Rosie, stop. Okay. So it really isn't that much inside it. So I'm going to line this up and just cut off this bit. And again, I'm just using my art glitter glue just because I have it on hand and I don't really want to get my glue stick out. And again, I'm just going to glue this next one on there really well. this piece and then I'm going to just do a quick glue down of this side and then I'm just going to cut this off done all right Makes that very much easier. Oh my gosh. The interesting things they talk about. Again, my goal was just to use up scraps that I already had sitting. Um, can, can your friends what? Tomorrow? Why would they be setting up your beds for tomorrow? No, one of N uh, Not right now, babe. Okay. 
Again, this is just an easy way for me to have this very well set up. This one I am not distressing. I think it's good enough without distress. There's so much going on in it already. And there we go. We got this one done. A nice simple one, yet again. Rosie, can you please quit? I apologize. My youngest seems to think the world revolves around her today, which is not the case at the current moment. I don't know either. <coughs> I'm trying to think what I want to do next here. I think this one I'll save for a different day. I don't really feel like doing another one. Because I kind of want to decorate these. So. That's sometimes how it goes. You start feeling it. And then slowly decide that you're not feeling it anymore. Just thinking. What could we add to this? Just to give it an added look. And I'm thinking this. That just gives it something. This and maybe a uh, what you would call it label on it. I haven't used stickers in a while, but that sticker definitely added some charm there. I like this, but I want to make it smaller. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm just taking a simple pair of scissors here. Maybe another piece of paper or something to that's lighter or a piece of fabric even. Would this piece of fabric just melt into it too quick too much though? Yeah. Okay. What if I add a simple piece of lace behind it? Ooh. That would kind of bring that out. Yes. Sometimes you just gotta grab around and see what will happen.
there. I think that added just that little bit added a lot to it. All right, this one. I think that's it out of this set that I want. Now, what if I use something like that on it? Uses it up. I think so. Again, I'm just trying to use up what I have. I really liked using this die cut. But in all reality, I'm never going to use this die cut if I don't just use it. It's one of them things you just have and you never use because <laughs> one thing or another and it just, again, sits. So just adding it to my use it up journal will work and that was the point of using my vintage fabric I want to say digital was and it's only 50 cents because I wanted to be able to make a use it up journal of different things and this was one of them so there we go we got our two envelopes with this style and I'm gonna put this away in my idea area so it can be used again and I'm starting to actually have an overflow of that so I might be changing that up but this is what I have done today and that's going to go into a different area and I want to do a quick show so I'm going to stick my hand right here so it isn't so weary but I bought this lovely little um, project cart from We Are Memory Keepers. And oh my goodness, this is amazing. It's got all my stuff sorted out, my going to be projects, the ones I'm currently working on and stuff like that. So I'm gonna stick my hand right in front again so you don't get all dizzy moving around and I hope you have a great day or night. Bye.